my name is Sochi Martinez Carnia. I'm 19 years old and I started coming to Si Se Puede Academy in February 2023. Find their factors. Sochi is a new mom. Her son Agustin was born in mid-June, bringing joy and new responsibility. In her senior year at Federal Way High School, Sochi found out she was pregnant. Her pregnancy and traditional school hours were not working, so she dropped out. Still, Sochi wanted to complete her high school education. She would find an opportunity nearby at El Centro de la Raza's Federal Way site, where the approach is, yes, we can, si sí se puede. One of the topics will be factors and multiples. One. My name is Juan Flores. I am the GED instructor here at um, Cizapoid Academy. I go by El Profe Nito. El Profe means um, professor or instructor. Um, Nito is my nickname growing up. Cisa Puede Academy is a dual language GED testing prep center. Um, we offer courses, sessions, both virtually and in person, in English and in Spanish. We tend to focus on innovation and flexibility. You three times. It is here that jóvenes, the Spanish word for young people like Sochi, age 18 to 21, work with El Profenito to pass the general educational development test the equivalent of a high school diploma. We begin with the learning plan and seeing what works for them. Um, we discuss the schedules of the Hoveness, and so we'll accommodate. So there's things that go on in their lives. Um, we offer sessions later in the afternoon. We offer virtual sessions on the weekends. Um, so there's opportunity for, um, for Hoveness to have the accessibility. Push the boot like right there. Accessibility and flexibility are key ingredients here. Sochi and the other Hoveness have families, jobs, and circumstances where an out-of-the-box approach works best. For me, it means that I'm able to be home with my baby. I'm so being able to let my teacher know I'm going to be busy from like one to like three. Is it possible if I can join like at 10 a.m. or if I can join like at 4 p.m.? Our motto is solution-based. So if it's videos that Hovindus needs in English or Spanish, if it's practice questions being texted to them, if it's a phone call of, hey, how's it going, checking in. The CSIP Weather Academy opened its doors on Halloween of 2022. Sochi is thankful she says without the opportunity here, she would not have continued her education. I feel very lucky because I know a lot of people don't have resources and the ability to continue their education after going through a teen pregnancy like I did. And, you know, just having uh, the support of everyone here has been just amazing. It's like having like a second family. To promote that family feeling, as well as provide some fun and informative experiences, the Cisepueda staff take the Jovenes on field trips to the zoo, to visit museums, to go kayaking, to learn CPR, to see movies, and attend conversations about Latino issues and culture. Right, and it kind of challenges them to be in those positions and be adaptable and yeah, just kind of reconfigure the mindset. As the CSIP Weather Academy wraps up its first year of operation in Federal Way, three students have graduated. More will follow as students throughout King County can attend virtually. The GED is not just a diploma, but it's something that you can tell changes of Hoven's perspective. You could see the confidence that they're building and seeing themselves in a different light. Sochi Martinez Coronia is making good progress toward her GED. She is looking to the future with hopes of one day becoming a nurse. She's very intellectual. She has the potential to do great things. She shows up consistently, figures out who's gonna babysit, you know, like we said, solution-based to get herself to take the test. To El Centro, I want to say, Thank you for allowing me to continue my education.
they're supporting a community of people who have dreams they want to follow and who want to continue their education. Viva el Centro de la Raza!